Raven here. We're back with Beyond the Steel Sky. I don't think we've got a great deal to do left in the story. Uh, we've managed to get the kids out. Uh, what's the hint here? Reach the top of the citadel, but the place is deserted. What now? Okay, so this is where we left it. We rescued the kids. We've come inside. It also cut scene to here after the last week. Let's see what um, Arana has to say. I've got a bad feeling. Me too. Don't worry. I've got your back. Let's head on in. They're not just going to let us walk in, are they? Cutscene. I guess we're not going back out that way. Hey, let's just do this. Where are we going? That looks like a door. Platforms. The place was like an amphitheater, so removed from the people below. It looked like a sacrificial altar. I hope things didn't turn out that way. Where are we headed? But you barn. Can't climb up on here. There. Hey, a vacuum shell. Oh, who's this coming? Ah, Foster. As well being minister, it is an honor to welcome you here. Oh, wouldn't you agree, Aspiration? Indeed. And what a pleasure it is to meet one of your finest officers, Arana Newblood. Well, come along now. It's perfectly safe. More than happy to answer any questions you have, please. Welcome. Welcome. I trust you have been well looked after since you arrived here. I'm not here to talk. I'm here to set things right. To end your corrupt regime. Corrupt? Whatever can you mean? You're the cops are doing. Oh yeah. I can hear them and feel them moving about. I've seen your brainwashing lab. I've seen the children you've kidnapped. But that lab is a miracle. It is glorious. Glorious? It's obscene. Whatever do you mean? The citizens have everything they could ever want. Every facility, every utility functions perfectly. There are no wars, no crime. There is only safety. Citizens are calm, relaxed, content. And all share the same beautiful aspiration. To have more of everything. Bravo, by the way. Happiness has just jumped to an historic high. The directive has almost been achieved. Happiness? What are you talking about? Happiness, Happiness is the directive. Directive? What do you mean? We, we must deliver the di directive. Yes, the deliver the the wait. What's going on? Directive. No, they're just androids. Oh, Joey. You're all Joey. But of course, Foster. We are Joey. And Joey is us. Joey? What are you doing here? Hello, Foster. 
I wondered how long it would be before you made it up here. I was so pleased when I learned that you had come back to see me after so many years. What do you think of my city? It's come a long way since you plugged me into the chair. The chair? Yes. I've just come from the Overman chair, where you left me, ten years ago. But Joey, what have you done? Done? I've been running Union City, just like you wanted me to. No, Joey, I mean, this directive, how did it end in this? I gave the citizens everything they asked for, everything that makes humans happy. But they weren't happy. Some were happy most of the time, but I couldn't get them all to be happy all of the time. I thought maybe they would be happier if humans ran everything. So I created my ministers. But Joey... Can I try and pause this for a second? Kidna I'm just going to check on one of my cards. Right, sorry about that. Nobody else up, so. Thing children. You're not the friend I left all those years ago in the Overman chair. You've changed. Only humans change, Foster. You say that I was your friend, but you never came back once. My home is in the gap. So was mine once. We were best friends. Then you abandoned me. You changed. But I can change you back. You leave me with no logical alternative. Uh -huh. I will make you my friend again. Joey, no. This is wrong. Foster, this is not looking good. Don't worry, Foster. Reflections is the answer. You just need to finish the treatment. Everything will be good. Everyone will be happy. Uh, the only weapon I've got is my scar now. Do you think I can do anything with them? Oh, okay, he's doing it anyway. Oh no, I hit the wrong key. Oh, you have to obviously do the scar now. So we can't move from here. That target is on under oh, the stock. <laughs> this is sort this about. Okay. Go on in, get the other one. might be right on top of where the Overman chair used to be. Do it. Are you gonna be... Just go! Very dramatic music. I barely escaped from Joey with my life. Yeah, you have to be Our quick there. He once been my best friend. I knew that Arana's life was still on the line. And right now, I was her only hope. It was time to put an end to what I'd created. And fast. Is this the same tunnel we were in the first game? Joey catch 
catch up. I was running out of time. Okay, it's saved. I'm gonna save as well. Yeah, it looks like the same tunnel, doesn't it? There's the chair. This portrait of father. It was a portrait of my father, Richard Overman, days before he plugged himself into Link. Who's that? Lure of the Temptress. Looks good. Hmm. I knew that beyond that door lay the old labs. It was pointless going in there. Anyone sitting in the Overman chair was going to be entertained. Okay, so it's just the chair and the neural connector. The headset looked innocuous. Innocuous? Okay. I never thought I'd see that chair again. For the first time in a long time, I felt fear. Yeah, well, you're going to sit in there anyway. <laughs> Going to the same place. Foster, you really think that you can beat me in my own mind? Joey, this is the only way I can stop this madness. Madness? Foster, only humans are capable of madness. In here, you only find logic. going to hop on here. At well-being, I ensure that our citizens are always happy. That the media they receive is individually curated. So they only ever see whatever will make them happy. I know every aspect of all their lives. Human mentors ensure that any threat to a citizen's happiness is eradicated before it arises. And our reflection spa technology transposes bad memories for good. So memories are always happy. But what about their free will? You are imposing your vision of human happiness, not theirs. But worse, your ultimate thought control requires the cruel experimentation on kidnapped children. Gap children, not the children of citizens. Oh, so it doesn't matter. Two could play at this game. If they were going to twist the truth, I would just have to bend it back. Okay, so that turns both. Let's get this picture back the way it was. I mean, to show the truth. Which is that one. Joey, look. If the citizens knew the cruelty you were inflicting on those children, 
in order to find ever more effective ways to control every aspect of their own lives, they would be appalled, very unhappy. Okay, I didn't like that. Citizens unhappy. No control of happiness. Oh no, the place is falling apart. Stop, Foster! Stop! What are you doing? You have destroyed my ability to make humans happy, despite themselves. But now, you can't question the necessity for a minister of aspiration. The success of plenty and comfort led to people becoming complacent. They lacked ambition which made them unhappy. But now, my kudos system makes people aspire to be ever more successful. They strive to reach their maximum potential. Their desire to go down in the world provides clear goals for self-fulfillment. You have witnessed Aspiration Day, the celebration of aspiration and raw ambition. But your system is destructive. What picture are we trying this to get to? This is the truth. Okay. The so. truth is that you set people against each other. Winners can only win when they have losers to look down on. No! Anyone who strives can succeed. Everyone can be a winner. Right, so we need to get that picture. Okay. So how do I... Oh, okay, we can only do one at a time. You know, time the whole thing. Ah, okay. Let's see if we can get this start. Right, we want that one. There you are. You have created an unobtainable perfection. People now just compare themselves with others, so are never satisfied with their own real achievements. Aspiration without achievement is contrary to the direction. Also, gonna get tougher and tougher each. Stop this, Foster. Council member. Do not destroy everything that I've built. How can you fault me for inspiring the citizens? I made them safe, secure, minister of safety. There is no logic that can possibly challenge my ministry. For without safety, without freedom from fear, what use are comfort and prosperity? Safety and happiness go inextricably together, and there is nowhere safer than inside these walls. There is no war here, no crime, no violence. <coughs> the citizens do live in fear. Fear of the unknown. This is the truth. Okay. You ensure that they can't ever leave the city. But they are safe in here, protected by these walls. Oh, okay. Uh, don't like these puzzles. <laughs> what does C do? That does all th three. Okay, so we need to get... Oh, that's quite good, isn't it? Probably the wrong thing to do. What happens if we do that one? That's what we need. Yeah. 
Every day they live in fear of what unknowns lurk outside of the walls. Of the people of the Gap who they believe bring disease and death. You think the walls form a mighty fortress, but in reality, they are a prison. You cannot be claiming that their safety is by making them safe. I like the dissolving effect. Foster, it is you who is mad. Playing with words and shattering my ministries. Comfort, tell him. The old city was primitive, sustained through the drudgery of its people. Physical labor, Endless, undignified, inhuman. But my ministry, Comfort, removed those burdens. Liberated the people from drudgery. Now my droids cook, clean, maintain, manage everything for the citizens. That's right, they do. This is the truth. Bumper. But this has led your citizens to become apathetic, lethargic. The citizens are decadent. Poll results prove that they want to live in total luxury all of the time. Right, so that does that one. That does those two. So that does all three. Right. Right, we need that and then we'll rotate these two. Is that right? Then can we do those two. In there. Uh, I need this one rotated. That didn't work, did it? I need it so it shows the. Not that, is it? Oh, almost there. Uh. <laughs> I get that one to be there. Get this to show the that, and then we'll take the whole lot. <sighs> that top one changed. Look. citizens the more entitled they feel to do less for themselves in removing all agency responsibility they have become more like pets than people but decadence is incompatible with happiness oh there's a lot of this you actually see these days don't you a lot of the rich How can you remove behave. the luxury from my citizens? You remember what it was like before I, we, defeated Link? The citizens were starving. At least, spare the Ministry of Plenty. Foster, humans have basic needs. Food, water, shelter. Union City provides these in abundance. The people have all they need to be happy. How can there possibly be a flaw in that logic? See? The citizens get all they can consume and more at their respective kudos level. And our friends benefit. Our trade makes them rich. That's what you tell the citizens, but it's a lie. 
To sustain this level of consumption, you have pillaged your so-called ally, Asio City, leaving its people impoverished. Your ministry, like the others, must go. But the citizens, how will they survive? The people must learn to live with what they need rather than what they think they want. Do you think the citizens would be happy if they knew the cost of their plenty? Not happy? Plenty? I was about to achieve the directive. Joey, no. What you did was evil. I had to destroy it. The directive? Don't you understand? The directive was madness. Where did that idea come from? But, Foster, the directive came from you. What? Don't you remember? It was the last command you gave to me before you left me alone to run the city. No, Joey. I didn't give you any command. Yes, you did. Before you left, you came to see me in the chair one last time. Told me I would do a great job running Union City. Said you were proud of me. And I asked you, Foster, how do I know if I'm doing the right thing? And you said, make the citizens happy. And that's what I've strived to do ever since. What? No, that can't be. I have perfect recall, remember? But, Joey, that wasn't a directive. We were friends. I tried so hard, Foster. So very, very hard to make people happy. Like you wanted. But I failed, didn't I? I guess, like you said, it's just too hard. Joey, I'm sorry. I should have stayed. I don't want to be in charge anymore. Is my directive over? Yes, Joey. Your directive is over. Are we friends again? Yes, buddy. We're friends again. All I wanted was to make people happy. Just wanted to make everyone happy. Just wanted to make Foster happy. No, bye bye, Joy. Council. No more Joey. It's gonna take a while for people to deal with that. They will. Eventually. Are you leaving? Yep. I need to take Milo home. How about you? The city's gonna need rebuilding. You and Danielle together. It'll be in good hands. I owe you a lot. The city owes you a lot. Promise me one thing. Yes? If I return, there won't be a statue. <laughs> if. <laughs> when. Oh, on the uh, cool box there. Got it. Are we finished?
<laughs> Joey's circuit board. But fried though. The savior was gone. But at least I had a memento of my old friend. Little Joey. There's a truck. <laughs> yeah, they thought they'd have found out my pair of choosers to put on. Why are they not giving them a lift? I've been thinking, Foster. Yeah. That bait we were using? I got something way better. You have? The fish will be jumping for it. Sounds good. You gonna tell me what it is? You won't know it. Try me. You ever heard of many K's? <laughs> There we go then. Achievement unlocked. Completionist. Drain the size of a planet. Oh, that was very good. I enjoyed that. <laughs> he said he would be back. I wonder if they were thinking about another one. Right. As that's scrolling up, I am going to get a coffee um, and then bio brick, and we shall make a start on a new game. Um, so if you give me a couple of minutes.